Next is the reverse lunge. This is similar um, in, in the fact that we are still going to be in a split squat type position, except it's more dynamic in nature, meaning that there is going to be movement going on instead of being in a static and stationary position like we were with the split squat. So in this one, we also do a prisoner style where we keep the hands behind the head, except this time we're going to step back into a split squat position or a lunge and then forward. And then we would alternate legs and then come back up. It's just a great exercise and it's a good progression up from a split squat. It does take a little bit more balance, more flexibility, and a little more strength in order to do this versus just a stationary and a static position like the split squat. From the side, it looks like this. Prisoner style, chest up, step back, and back, opposite leg, and back. So this is your reverse lunge. Same rules apply as the split squat. You're going to keep your head up, chest up, eyes up, elbows back. Maintain that tall position. That is a reverse lunge.